human beings pass away through different means, either by sickness, road accident, poisoning, etc. But one of the most common ways which people also pass away is through slumping and dying. And that is what I am going to talk about briefly in this video. When people slump and pass away, it is sometimes difficult to determine the cause of death without an autopsy. This is because many people that slump and pass away look healthy as if nothing is wrong with them until something happens. Medical experts have said that for people to slump and pass away, the brain and the heart must be involved. Hello everyone, welcome back to Ifechi Health and Wellness. This video I, I, is inspired by what I've been hearing recently. You know, I just recorded a video talking about you know, chronic illnesses and people suffering from many types of illnesses at a time. Now, when this, um, I heard some things about people slumping, people passing away, both here in the UK, but in Nigeria, all over the world, it happens all the time. And it's now on the increase. So I decided to look into this brief to bring some things for us to consider. You know, if the heart is diseased in different forms, it can cause the heart to stop working and the person can slump and pass away. And if the blood vessels has problems, that is what causes stroke. And it is, if it's very severe, the person can actually slump and pass away. You know, people, especially adults, slump and pass away for various reasons. Apart from what I just talked about, the heart disease and things like um, heart attack, stroke, stress, and even malaria from, what, uh, from the research I did. So for purpose of this video, I'm going to just look into some of the simple things that can cause somebody to slump and pass away without getting into too, too medical into it. Just the simple things that we, if we look into, it will cover every other thing like heart disease, this and all that. All I'm going to say now is going to be very uh, straight to the point to a layman who will now and but it will cover every other thing that may cause people to slump and pass away. And what is the major one? Stress. Apart from slumping and passing away, stress is one of the leading causes of several health uh, conditions in, human, in humans. People tend to overwork themselves and not give enough time to their body to rest. There may be there are many things that can cause someone to stress unnecessarily. It could be work, travel, business, fair relationship, family issues. If you are the type that likes to stress yourself over work or business, etc., you have to take your time. Rest and sleep properly. Life is too short and life is only once. You can even take a vacation, travel, look at new places, relax. You don't have to go too far. Just get out of your environment. Rest because life is is for the, is for the for living another thing apart from stress the next thing which i say covers every other thing we're talking about like uh, is poor diet our body needs as much healthy food as possible and that is not to be overemphasized you can't ever emphasize this you know unfortunately many people do not care about what they eat and they eat whatever they see or like I'm going to give a shout out to Annie's Insight. Annie's Insight, her name will come up on the screen. She's been doing a v, uh, recording some things, looking into the calorie contents of some of the foods we eat back home in Nigeria. She listed a lot of them, things we don't even pay attention to. You know, things like this, uh, kilishi or whatever they call it, and uh, shawarma, and uh, even abacha uh, anowa, and all the rest of it. Those things, those local foods that we eat, we think that, okay, you know, sometimes we don't look at into those things. We only look at other foods and stuff like that, and we don't look at our native foods. Go to her channel. I love the way she was, she took her time to analyze those things and look into the calorie content of those foods. Please check it out. It's very, very important so that you know. I'm not saying not to eat all these things, but eat them to um, minimum. For example, a butter can be your main meal. 
You don't have to eat that as I start and then start eating again. It can be your main meal. So just, just be measured. You can have these things, but just incorporate them all in your meal. You know, you have to be deliberate about the types of food you eat. You can always eat fruits and vegetables in replacement for unhealthy junk, junks and snacks. I told you when I did the video about sweet potatoes and uh, carrots that my snack most of the time is, uh, um, you know, I have carrots as my snack. Just cut them and just be um, taking them. Sometimes I combine them with celery and just be biting on them. Just change. Just try and do something to help yourself. Having a poor diet can be can lead someone to slump, slump and pass, a, pass away, according to experts. Another thing is obviously cardiac arrest. Cardiac arrest have no disease attached to it. It just happens suddenly, especially when someone slumps, and this can lead to the person passing away. It's only uh, during autopsy that they will identify, oh, this is actually the cause of, of death. So, Cardiac arrest is one thing. People will just slump and pass away like that due to cardiac arrest. But when you look into this uh, stress and poor diet and everything around these two major th uh, things, very you, the, we go through these things every single day. If we look into this, make sure that we, we once, once we are alive, we are going to have stress, one kind of stress or the other. But we can do things to minimize our stress. We can choose not to be it, can, it cannot be stress free once you're breathing there's no way it can be stress free i agree however we can do things to minimize our stress to know that if anything happens to us i had this news recently here in london where somebody just finished eating their lunch went for a, for a meeting and in the midst of uh, that meeting the lady slumped and before uh, uh, emergency service could you know come to attend to her she was gone had I had about three recently here in the UK, and I've had about quite a few in, in, in back home, and I'm sure this happened all over the world. I heard about these ones because they were people that I know that knew those people, and they talked to me about it. And I said to myself, and one of them said to me, actually, it would be nice to talk about this. That's why I want to make this quick video for us to please know people are slumping a lot and passing away. Don't know when somebody passes away like that, you start going to your village, people start going, oh, who did this to this person and that. No, nobody's doing anything to anybody. Even if they are doing, that is not the what, what I'm here today to talk about. I'm here to talk about our general health and the fact that we need to be very, very careful looking to what we eat, what calories, what the label on the foods you buy is very, very important. Our people eat too much, they, they eat all these things, and you see them drinking either Coke or, or you know, all these uh, mineral drinks to wash it down or malt. All these are colored sugar, you're using that to even do more harm to yourselves. Please, this is just a quick video because of this slumping here and there. And I want to just bring our attention to this. Please be very, very careful. Look after your health. Look after the health of your children and your family. God bless you. Until I see you again. Goodbye.